Good evening, welcome to Real Time. I'm your host, Catherine Mochler. Thousands of pro-life advocates have marched in Berlin, demanding an end to abortion and for full legal protections to be restored to unborn children. Over 4,000 courageous pro-life people gathered in the German capital for the annual March for Life. Pro-life demonstrators demanded an end to abortion and called for human life to be protected from the moment of conception. The Berlin March for Life took place only two weeks after the March for Life in London, which recorded its largest turnout yet, with over 7,000 pro-lifers attending. SPUC has stated that it is inspiring to see so many people take a stand against abortion and that each day we are moving closer to our pro-life future. Bishop John Keenan of the Diocese of Paisley has defended an SNP politician who received a written warning from his party after vocalising his support for pro-life vigils and opposing attempts to ban them. John Mason, the Glasgow Shelton MSP, has stated that some abortion providers can often push abortion and described how the pro-life vigil attendees that he encountered were not hateful or harassing. Consequently, SNP party whips issued Mr Mason with a warning letter stating that the SNP considers his comments to be a serious breach. Responding to the SNP's treatment of Mr Mason, Bishop Keenan has called for respect of freedom of expression and has stressed that parties like the SNP must avoid political censorship. A buffer zone has been implemented at the Robert Clinic in the King Norton area of Birmingham. Birmingham City Council's three-year public space protection order was introduced on September 7th and restricts pro-life people from offering support to mothers near abortion clinics. SPUC has stated that pro-life vigils are loving acts which intend to support mothers and save lives. Buffer zones demonstrate the anti-democratic lens that pro-abortion advocates will go to in an attempt to silence the pro-life voice and presence. And finally, SPUC is thrilled to be hosting three pro-life conferences in cities across the UK in October. SPUC's first conference will take place in Birmingham on Saturday the October 8th. The London conference will take place on October 22nd, followed by the Glasgow conference on the 29th. For more information or details on how to book your place, please see the details posted below this video. From SPUC's newsroom, I'm Catherine and this is Real Time. Thank you for tuning in. See you again next week. Same time, same place.